Hi, I'm Jessica Swindle, Director of the Florida Coastal Conservancy in Port St. Joe, Florida. I'm here to tell you about our incredible sea turtles that call this area home. Did you know that this area hosts four out of Florida's five species of sea turtles? The most common species you'll find here are the green turtles, which forage in the lush seagrass beds of St. Joseph Bay and the nesting loggerheads. In fact, St. Joseph Peninsula has the highest density nesting beach in Northwest Florida. Sea turtles are one of the oldest creatures on earth and their populations are declining. They live their whole life in the sea and only come on shore to lay their eggs. We love them and we are excited that they have chosen our beaches as their nesting site from May to October. Our volunteers work tirelessly to protect and educate people about these amazing creatures. They respond to stranding events, which means the turtle needs medical attention to return to their habitat, document and safeguard nests during nesting season, and work hard to ensure that we all play a role in the well-being of our sea turtles. If you are visiting our beaches during nesting season from May to October, there are some really important things you can do to help too. In Gulf County, the Leave No Trace Ordinance helps protect our turtles. And you can do your part by remembering the phrase, clean, flat, and dark. Clean, clear the way at the end of the day. Make sure you remove beach toys, chairs, tents, and kayaks no later than one hour after sunset. That's the law, but it is also imperative for our sea turtles. Sea turtles often get blocked or stuck under tents and chairs, which can prohibit nesting and endanger their lives. Flat. Digging in the sand is fun, but holes should be filled in before you leave the beach for the day. Beachgoers and visitors can help protect sea turtles and prevent accidents by filling in holes and collapsing sand castles on the beach. These holes pose a risk to nesting sea turtles and hatchlings. You can start over and build a brand new one the next day. Dark. If you are using lights, Make sure they are turtle-friendly red lights, or even better, turn off all lights to enjoy the stunning night sky in this area. As sea turtles approach a beach from the sea, these females instinctively seek out dark places to deposit their eggs. Bright lights can deter females from coming ashore at all, or disorient emerging hatchlings who are trying to make their way to the water. If you are lucky enough to witness a nesting sea turtle or an emerging hatchlings, turn off all lights, observe from a distance, and enjoy this incredible ancient ritual. We invite you to learn more and to support our efforts by visiting us at the Forgotten Coast Sea Turtle Center in Port St. Joe, or check us out online at floridacc.org, where we offer a variety of information for our community and visitors about our area sea turtles and our conservation and research efforts.